Thank you for taking a moment to watch my video. I'm tying a fly that I used on the Green River in my past video. I'm calling it the OP Prism Torch because it uses Orange Peacock. It's a variation of my Prism Torch. Let's go ahead and begin. These are the fly tying materials. The hook is a jig four size 14 with a four millimeter tungsten rose gold bead from Fulling Mill. I mean, Hannock. We're gonna use some orange yarn, Darlin is the brand I use. You can use anything you want. Let's just go ahead and Tie that in, pinch in, tie that in. All the way back to the bead. I like to go right to the bend. Once you see it bend down, and then I do a couple underneath to bring it back up. Now we're gonna tie in some gold brassy or BR. Then we've got some yellow Mirage tinsel. Tying in. Then we'll get some of these peacock curls. I use two. And we'll start wrapping these forward. Or the bead. Then we'll take the millar, go opposite way we Tied in the uh, peacock and run that through the body. Use the gold wire and this will help secure the tinsel from the fish's teeth all the way to the bead head. There we go. Helicopter that off. Once you secure it. Tell. Now we're going to add the, it's, this color is March brown, but any brown, lighter brown will work. I typically like to have this, the hair a little bit shorter than the one I'm using, but this will be fine. I like to tie it in this way now. with the point of the feather towards the back rather than point of the feather 
towards the front. Grab our hackle pliers. And stroke these back. As you come up, stroke them back. Should have trimmed. There's a little bit more hair fibers than I would have liked, but it's okay. It still will work. And the finishing touch is SLF Prism Hair's Ear for a hot spot on the collar. Get a nice dubbing noodle. Make one turn, two turns actually there. Grab your whip finisher. And secure it with a couple thread wraps. Whip finish. Okay, and it's done. OP Prism Torch. Orange Peacock Body. Thanks for watching.